A word of warning, upholstery does mean flying tax and a bit of dust. So an essential part of your kit should be some protective eyewear and a dust mask. We have some strong steel pins here. They are stronger than your dressmaking pins. They just won't bend and they can hold the fabric firm. If your pin won't hold, you can move up to your upholstery skewer. These are called regulators. They're very specific to upholstery for helping you get your fibres in place and getting your covers nice and tight. You will need a selection of curved needles. A spring needle with this wider end for getting through the tight weave of webbing and a selection of different sized curved slipping needles. Double-ended needles, not to be confused with the regulator. They come in different sizes for different sized chairs. This one here is a bayonet used for stitching through the stuffing. They're double-ended in, in as much that there's a point at each end, but there's only one eye. This is a little buttoning needle. It's just round, no bayonet. When finishing off your fabric close to show wood, you will find a punch useful. Not one that goes to a sharp point, but with a nice flat edge to put on your tack and a decent hammering point, better chance of hitting it. This paddle here is just really useful for helping you to tuck fabrics through between the back and the seat and the arms. As you can see, we have some very sharp points here. Please keep those covered with a cork when they're not in use and keep everything stowed in a nice toolbox.